This is stock number 21T110. We are here at Summit Automotive in Fond du Lac, Wisconsin. Your new and used heavy duty truck and Ram headquarters. Today we are checking out this brand new 2021 Ram 2500 crew cab short box with the Ram box. Power wagon level two. This vehicle has the 6.4 liter V8 motor, V8 Hemi motor. Patriot blue metallic over black clear coat is the color. We shoot all of our videos in 1080p, 60 frames per second. So if you have HD capabilities on your computer, tablet, or smartphone device, turn them on right now because it is definitely your best way to check out the looks and styling of the vehicle before seeing it in person. And if you'd like to check out all the photos on this truck in the upper right hand part of your screen is a link to our website. Click that and check us out there. So this one has the Power Wagon Off-Road Group. So you get the rock rail slash step bars right there. That's part of that group. And then you get the beadlock capable 17 inch alloy rims. And this one has Goodyear Wrangler LT 285 70R 17 tires. Definitely like a mud terrain um, tire on there. You get the Bilstein shocks. Patriot Blue, one of my favorite colors on the Rams. It's got just a little bit of metal flake in it. If you have your HD capabilities on, you can see that. Have the LED headlamps, the LED running lights, the LED fog lamps. It does come with the worn winch on there. Front bumper parking sensors. And uh, you get the Ram stamped grill with the power wagon. This one does have a black hood decal on it. Kind of hard to see with how dark the truck is, but I think it's a nice accent on there, especially being two-tone like that. We'll take a look at the original window sticker. Feel free to pause this at any point. I'm not going to go through everything, but just some of the main points on here. You can see 2021 Ram power wagon. 6.4 Hemi, 8-speed automatic transmission, 4.10 axle ratio, comes with the true lock front and rear axles, as well as the front disconnecting stabilizer bar and um, front electronic electric winch, which really is the main part of the power wagon group. Patriot Blue Pearl is 100 bucks towing technology group, which gives you the cargo view, as well as the 360 cam is $1,095, and then the safety group, which gives you the digital rear view mirror, lane keep assist, full speed collision warning plus, adaptive cruise control and adaptive steering system and blind spot with cross path detection is $1,990. Power wagon off-road package, which gives you those rock rails and the special rims is $1,995. The Ram box utility group is $295. And then um, the Power Wagon Level 2 group is $5,845. That gives you the leather trimmed 40 20 40 split bench seating in the front, the ventilated seats, the heated seats, second row and floor storage bins, power folding tow mirrors, um, the dual climate controls, rain sensitive windshield wipers, remote tailgate release, second row um, heated seats, two way power lumbar, eight way power adjustable. Um, front seat as well, driver's seat, rear door, accent lighting, radio driver's seat memory, automatic high beam control, mirror mounted auxiliary lamps, heated steering wheel, um, memory pedals with power pedals, remote start, and then the floor mats. The electronic shift on the fly transfer case is $295, power sunroofs $1195, the 17 speaker Harman Kardon premium sound system $795, and the Uconnect 12 inch radio is $1995. But that gives you the off-road pages, the Sirius XM Guardian for a year, and Sirius XM 360, as well as the 4G LTE Wi-Fi hotspot. Um, also gives you Android Auto, Apple CarPlay, all that good stuff. Rambox Cargo Management System is $9.95, which includes the LED bed lighting. And then you get the dual alternators rated at 380 amps is $3.95. Total MSRP on this truck is $72,420. And if you want to get your summit price in the upper right hand part of your screen is a link to our website to get all the rebates and incentives on this particular truck. Uh, three year 36,000 bumper to bumper, five year 60 powertrain warranty on this truck. 
they don't give these um, fuel economy ratings they just kind of give them scores so greenhouse gas is C minus and smog is B minus and then the safety ratings five stars for side crash and three stars for rollover not rated for anything else um, so pretty safe vehicle there get the power wagon badge on the dash there and we'll come back to the interior this one does have the decals on the side with the power wagon now you could always remove those if you wanted um, but I think it would probably mess up your decal down here and look silly you get the ram box which is a really nice feature if you like them you have removable plugs down there so you can put ice and drinks in here you got these dividers uh, with the slots here that you can put in there to divide stuff up little management system you also have LED lighting back here which must have to turn on with the lights but that locks with the key, key fob get the LED tail lamps backup parking sensors full towing package of course with the receiver hitch 4 pin and 7 pin wiring you get the ram stamped tailgate and the power wagon sticker on the back there now this is a shock down assist so it has the power release and you don't have to worry about it slamming down to get these lights on you can press the button which is actually on the inside of the tailgate there um, you get those lights the light up there notice the cargo management system with the tie down cleats and then you have the divider here which also can turn into a bed extender so pretty cool stuff back here tailgate's really light shuts nice and easily LED tail lamps RAM box on this side has a 115 volt 400 watt plug-in which is nice and these step bars are almost like a powder coating on there you get the heated fold-out tow mirrors so they fold out like so they also power fold in you get blind spot monitoring directional signals LED side lights and then here are your cameras for the 360 as well as the trailer tow assist um, parking assist and then you have the electronic keyless enter and go system once again the power wagon level 2 group gives you the black leather interior you get the power wagon stitched into the bolster there power driver seat with lumbar 40 20 40 split bench seating factory floor mats auto headlamps power pedals power windows power locks power mirrors these mirrors do fold in like so which is really nice especially when you have the big old tow mirrors and then you can actually control the blind spot mirror you gotta press this button and then pick which mirror you want to control and then uh, it'll actually control that outside mirror which is a really nice feature as well and then you get memory driver seat too we'll hop inside and take a look at all the options in here So you get the power wagon animation right there. Digital speedometer, compass display. You get a battery, voltage level, oil temp, and an instrument cluster. Looks really good. I like the power wagon logo up top there. Comes with the leather wrapped heated steering wheel. So this is cruise control. That's your adaptive cruise control. Gear selector information center controls Bluetooth and then you get audio controls on the back push button start 8-speed automatic transmission with the push button four-wheel drive you also have your sway bar disconnect right there axle locker or actually those are your axle lockers and then that's to unlock it and then down here you get two USBs two USB C's and an aux jack so this is the 8.4 4c radio um, gives you all the stuff that we discussed before including the factory navigation system also has AM FM and Sirius XM radio capabilities you can do your heated and cooled seats here and then you can also check out all your backup cameras here as well so you can check out your surround view camera which is really a cool system and when you're backing up these lines actually will turn with the vehicle and um, everything's super clear super 
HD. I actually pulled this truck out of our service shop before and that was so nice to have to make sure I wasn't going to hit any of our tire machines or any of the other lifts or anything. It was just a really nice system to have. And then you have your backup camera right there, which you can see just how crystal clear that is. Um, and you can do different views. You can do a wide view, a wide view in the front, a narrow view in the front, and then you have your cargo cam, which shows you what's going on in the bed of the vehicle. And then you can also just do your backup camera and then you can zoom in on your backup camera to over the hitch to get hooked up to your boat camper or trailer the first time every time. And once you're hooked up and you're backing your trailer up, you can use the trailer uh, park assist, which is this right here, which shows you down the side of the truck. So if you're backing your camper up or your boat, you can imagine having this to see where your boat or camper is going um, or trailer is a really nice feature. And you can choose the left or the right sides. Um, whatever you want to do. So really a cool system with this uh, tow technology group and all the cameras that come with this truck. Um, really a nice feature. Now this thing can do so much more. I mean like you have your off-road pages, you also have your projection manager where you can project your cell phone to the screen. So if you have Waze or Google Maps, you can project that to the screen and uh, use that if you like those better, or just music or media or whatever you want. And we actually did a demo on Android Auto if you want to check that out, it's in the upper right hand part of the screen. But then this one also has the um, off-road pages which are really cool too. And those take a second to load, but you can usually, other off-road pages from Chrysler uh, offered the um, latitude, longitude, um, pitch, um, angle, your vehicle dynamics, your steering wheel degrees which this one does the same thing whether you have your axles locked or unlocked if it's in two-wheel drive four-wheel drive sway bars connected or disconnected so you got all that stuff there you have your accessory gauges uh, which are pretty cool you got your latitude longitude your altitude there then you have your pitch and roll which is i can imagine if you're off-roading would be very helpful to know you know exactly what angle you're at and then you can just check out your forward facing camera and what's really neat about this is those are dynamic as well so as you turn your steering wheel you can kind of see where you're going to be going which once again if you're doing a lot of off-roading with this truck or in the woods a lot it would be really great to make sure you weren't going to hit stuff because if you look out the front this truck sits pretty high and you can't always see what's directly below the hood so really cool stuff there um great radio we could go over it for hours i bet uh but we don't have that much time factory brake controller downhill assist control stability control tow haul front and rear parking sensors you can turn those off and on you do get a 115 volt 400 watt plug-in down there you get the Harman kardon sound system and then you have the power rear view mirror camera which is really cool so that actually shows you a real view of what's going on behind you takes a little bit to get used to and you can adjust the brightness and you can also adjust the angle that that camera's at but that's really all you can do or you can just turn it off and have a normal mirror there so that's really cool as well up there you have your assist and sos buttons map lights power sliding rear window button power sunroof button and your power tailgate drop down button there as well home link buttons and then your power sunroof We'll take a quick look at the back seats and then we will take one more look around the vehicle. We'll do a final walk around with all the lights on. So these back seats are heated. Um, I was curious how they were going to do that. Normally they have the console and the heated seat buttons are on there, but they put them down here with the 40-20-40 split bench seat, and so that's kind of cool. Two USB plug-ins and then a 115 volt 400 watt plug-in back here. Um, get the latch child safety system back here as well for any child car seats, the power sliding rear window with built-in rear defrost. These seats fold up, you get the load floor still in the 2500s, which is nice. You get a nice flat area if you got pets. Put both sides down, they got a nice flat place lay. You got muddy boots or tools, put them down on there and you're not gonna wreck your nice heated leather seats. So this looks like the setup for the winch. That's your winch controller in there and, and the tow hook that goes on the front of it. Um, so that all comes with the vehicle. You have a receiver hitch reducer 
and in the floor you have your in-floor storage bins with removable containers for easy cleaning. You can put ice and drinks in there. And it's like you got too many coolers wherever you go. Side curtain airbags and child safety locks on the back doors. And we'll do one more final walk around here on the truck with all the lights on. Notice you got the LED license plate lights, the LED tail lamps. And I would personally like to thank you for checking out the video today and hopefully from this HD video, you will have been able to tell just how good looking this truck is. Learn a little bit about the Power Wagon, a little bit about the Power Wagon Level 2, the 12 inch Uconnect, some of the special cameras on this truck. Love the LED headlamps and uh, fog lights on here. And to see more pictures of this truck or one of our other 450 new and used cars, trucks, SUVs, minivans, Wranglers, half tons, three quarter tons, one tons, you name it, we got to go to that website right there, www.summitauto.com, full pictures and descriptions of every single vehicle from two locations, all at summitauto.com. And if you'd like to check out more HD videos, you can go to youtube.com slash summitauto. Remember to like, subscribe, and share on this video and all the videos that you see there. In fact, in a second, you will see a link to subscribe to our YouTube channel in the upper left, a link to more Ram 2500 truck videos like this one in the upper right, a link to uh, this vehicle on our website in the lower left, and a link to our latest video from on YouTube in the lower right. Click those, check us out, and we're super excited to be offering the 2021 Ram 2500 Crew Cab Short Box Ram Box Level 2 Power Wagon in Patriot Blue Metallic. Thanks again for checking out the video.